Hello, Internet, and welcome back to Final Fantasy III on the Super Nintendo. In the last episode, we stuffed a bunch of fish into Sid and saved his life for the good of the land. And then we came to this town and found out that the world is not as well as we left it a year ago, or a couple of months ago, if you're, you know, whatever. Doesn't matter. Wibbly wobbly, timey wimey. Moving on. Uh, but anyway, we're right outside of this town, to Zen, which we know from the first half of the game, uh, we used to be an imperial town, so we're gonna walk in here, and just kinda see what's going on. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. It wasn't me. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Okay, okay, uh, must have irritated Kefka. Uh, there are monsters inside, they keep petrifying everyone. Uh, you're using suitable relics? Okay, so if they petrify, I'm gonna need something that protects against petrify. Alright, so, we're going to have to put on the jewel ring, because that's the one thing that will protect against petrify against, these, the, against whoever's in there. Is, it, is, that, is that who I think it is? That's, that's fucking Sabin! Seven. Hey, Celeste. Let's head in. Uh, wait, um, kind of holding this up. If I move, the whole house will collapse. First, save the child that's in there. I can't hold this up forever, so get him out um, quick, huh? All right, so six. Got six minutes to pretty much get in here and get out. Uh, all right. Did I bring? Tell me I brought some. I did. I have seven smoke bombs. I'm going to use them effectively. So if I have to deal with more than two enemies, I'm moving on. I'm not grabbing any of these chests, by the way. If you're like, hey, why aren't you grabbing the chest? Some of them are traps. A lot of them are traps. Smoke, the freaking smoke bomb. Damn it. Damn it. I'm still smoke bombing. Get a, get me out of here. Alright. I need to get the kid out of here. I know one of these is a trap. One of these boxes is a trap. The other one isn't. So... Magicite. Okay, so that was definitely a good pull there. I'm scared. Don't worry. You're safe now. And that is a matter of opinion. Okay, smoke bomb. I know, I know, I'm pretty much being a coward during this right now, but... Uh, I'm not a fan... Oh god, okay, okay. I'm not a fan of freaking multiple enemies when I'm just one person. I'm not a fan of that kind of stuff at all. Oh, and they're gonna drain for me? Alright. Alright, alright. This will be the first time I've shown an Esper, and thank god it's an attack. So, prepare to see Chaos Wing from Manduin, because Beast he's, does pretty decent damage. I mean, that's. You gotta remember, this is a lot of low res stuff. They're, you know, really cool animation and stuff like that. There we go, get out of my face. Oh, a lot of XP, a lot of GP, and that was... See, that's one of the reasons I don't really like grabbing the chest from this area. A lot of them are flipping traps. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Just kill it, kill it. Kill them dead. Deadify them. Unalive them. There we go. I got a tonic. Yay for useless items. Alright, I'm not grabbing that chest. I'll grab this one. Hyper wrist. Come up through here. I'll grab this one. I just might have screwed myself. Yep. I screwed myself wasn't paying attention, I was like more worried about the items. See, that's another reason I hate these items. 
Oh, not a fan of this part of the game. What? This was the last time that I actually saved. Okay, so I got the kid. I grabbed the items on the way in this time. I got a pearl rod, a heal rod, the hyper wrist, and I'm getting out of this fight. Uh, and mad the magicite. So I got, I think, the four best items in the, the this section of the game. I'm cool. I am moving on. Let us get the club out of here. Because I am done with this stuff. God dang it. I think I'll have maybe... I got two smoke bombs left. And plenty of time. Yep. Okay. That's all I wanted. I just wanted to freaking get through this... This... This section. Okay, I'm gonna use this last smoke bomb. I know, I know, I'm a coward for running away from every single battle, but you know what? When I got one person in my party and they can drop it at a moment's notice, that's it. I, I'm sorry, I can't, I can't, I can't. I can't let him, I can't just let it happen like that. So I gotta try and keep her alive. Which I did. Savin was able to freaking hold the building up. Savin, you're alive! I am. <laughs> what? But of course, you think a minor thing like the end of the world was gonna do me in? I thought everyone was gone. I had given up all hope. But, fortunately, I was wrong. Now you're here, blah 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 blah, I hit the button too fast, thank you for being a retard. That's a bad word, it's a bad word. Uh, I know, I know. We'll, we smash Kepka and deliver peace unto the world. That's pretty much how the plan is going down, so... Alright, so we got our second party member. We got Sabin back in the party, so... You know what I'm gonna do with him. We gotta find which Esper he was working on. Could be... Oh, there we go. We'll give him Shiva. Yeah. We'll give him Shiva. I don't know why I went to the items. Um, we need to go into Relics first for him, because... He's the one that uses the Genji Glove and the Black Belt to expert efficiency. So we got Fire, Poison, Poison Claw we're going to have to change because a lot of things will be healed by Poison in this, in this world. It's kind of nasty actually, I don't like it. Um, do -do 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 and that is about it. And they are both level 22. So we just pretty much did that. I know there's a guy. There he is. There he is. The world's going to heck in a handbasket. Just look at this weird stone. If you want, I'll give it to you for 10 GP. Yes. Received the Magicite Seraphim. Which I believe. Uh, is one of the really nice ones. Yeah, Seraphim. Life at 5%, Cure 2, Cure... Yeah, let's give, uh, Saban Seraphim. Give him that. That's what we'll do. What do what you got to say? Many monsters nowadays attack with zombie, petrify, and the like. Have you equipped the suitable relics? Oh, well, let's see what you got for relics. Let's see, uh, I got... Okay. So I've got all the relics here as well. We'll check the uh, the weapon and armor shops, see if we can equip anything new on Seven and Celeste. If not, we will make a beeline out of here and end the video. Oh, I didn't mean to buy that. Oh, that's stupid. I'm stupid. I didn't mean to buy that. Oh well. You know what? We're gonna buy another fire knuckle. Because that seems like it's the most powerful thing Saban has available to him. 
so we'll make sure that we are double the fire, double the pleasure, double the fun. Bam! And now he is just a beast at this. So, now I believe it's just we are on a hunt for our friends at this point, so if you like this video, press the thumbs up button under the screen. If you really like it and want to see more, subscribe and be on the lookout for more. When we continue on in the next episode, or the next video, pretty much I'm going to continue walking across the land until I find one of my party members. And we're going to continue on. But until that video, peace out. I'll eat the 8-ball. Yummy! Who knew an 8-ball tasted so good? Shazam! Waldo Winkleberg is Walking across the landscape of the land of dooms and stuffs, they get attacked.